Morning everyone, how are you? Oh, today it's a pin mail video. I'm so excited. I'm slowly getting through my pin mailbox. Um, so I've got some pins I bought, some I've traded for, um, and some very special, special editions. So catch me the other side of the intro. Hit it maestro. coughing my, my, my throat I think it's all the swimming I'm doing um, but it's working so it doesn't matter does it so shall we have a look I've got quite a few pins to show you today I figured out I looked in my pin mail box and I've got currently enough for about two more videos and um, because I do like to show you a lot don't I but I've got so many pins coming and um, I might have the doorways to Disney coming I might have the whole set coming. I'm so excited. So yeah, so they've been posted, so I'm waiting for those, those will be a week or two. So um, yeah, I'm really, really, really excited. So shall we start, shall we see what we've got today? So I'm gonna show you my very, very special pins first. So if any of you on Instagram want to go and see uh, live sales or um, pin opportunities, you've got to head over to Daisy Pins. They're lovely, um, Alex and Stacy. They're so, so lovely. Um, really, really nice, really nice people. They're based over in California. And um, yeah, they got these pins on and before Alex had finished, was it Alex or Stacy? No, it was Stacy was showing them. And before she'd actually finished showing the second one, I'd put sold. <laughs> you know when you're on your phone and you got nails and you and it takes you longer than anyone else you've got to get in there first and she had two sets and I, I was very lucky and I got one of the sets and they come and they're beautiful and they're humongous so I'll show you can you hear I love do you know that's one of the things I love most is the plastic sound when you buy new pins is that weird it's like I suppose when you buy a leather jacket it's the smell of the leather to me it's the rustle of the plastic not the bubble wrap the plastic so look Up until this 60th anniversary of Sleeping Beauty, I did not collect Sleeping Beauty or Aurora pins. I like Maleficent because I like the dragon. Um, well, that's kind of changed, doesn't it? It's kind of changed quite a lot, that has. So, please, let me take them out so I can show you them. So there was three, and these are cast member exclusives, and they're a limited edition of, have a look. 250 so there's only 250 of each of these pins <laughs> and Karen in Canada has got a set <laughs> don't quite know how that worked out but anyway so the first one so this is so this is the first one so as you can see this is the dragon on the front and when you open it up you've got Maleficent inside Aren't these beautiful? How lovely are these? And they're really big pins as well. Really big. I mean, if you look at the size, it's at least two thirds of my finger, if not more. So, so yeah, so that's, yeah, so that's lovely. So that was the first one. I don't need to put it back in plastic now. I can put them up on my pin board. Yay! And I've sorted my pin boards out. Um, and I'm, I'm currently selling pins on Disney pin trading and all different sites. Um, so my collections are getting smaller, so I'll be able to do um, a collection video soon. Because before they were just all over the place. So, right, next one. Three fairies, look at this. Aren't they lovely? And again, you open it up. See that I'm trying to. Oh, there you go. So if I head it more towards the light and not towards the window, we're all right. But look at those. And then the last one in the set, and these, I mean, I paid a really good price. I, I will tell you how much I paid. So that's the, the original price on them 20, oh, 
it doesn't want to show, it doesn't matter. $25.95 and I paid $40 a pin. So I know that's, you know, a, a markup, but secondary market, you pay a lot more than that. So uh, to me, it was a, a, a whoop, it was a no-brainer. Let's close that one back. So this one is the Sleeping Beauty one. And then when you open it up, you've got Sleeping Beauty and her Prince Philip, like my Prince Philip. So, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm really thrilled. And, you know, the reason I was able to get those was the fact that I've been selling all my pins, so I've generated cash, and I can buy the ones that I really wanted, which is the same with the doorways. In a way, you're, like, you're swapping, aren't you? People are buying you pins, and then you're buying something that you really want, so I'm fine with that. It's not coming out of the bank, it's just coming out of my bag of bonds. <laughs> it feels all right with that as well. <laughs> Strangely enough. Right, so those are those ones. So what's the next one? I did a trade. Um, and this was with a lovely Candice. And as we all know, Beth is starting me off on a Chinese New Year kick. So, we got this one. Will it come into focus? Let's take it out of the box. Without completely wrecking the box, that's always a good idea, isn't it? I always put sellotape on the corners, I can never quite understand why. Right. Uh, you see, I haven't done this. I haven't took it out yet. So, that's the pin itself. Aren't these beautiful? It's got the little um, toggle. Is that the word for it? And I don't know if it's actually meant to be like an ornament. but Because it's got a hanging bit here. But it's actually a limited edition of 500. And look. So and you open it and it's the year of the pig. I thought that was absolutely beautiful. Absolutely, and I hadn't ordered them, so when I saw it, I was like, okay, <laughs> okay, me. <laughs> and then, and then, there's some more. I've got more here, I've got another three um, New Year pins as well. So let's get these out. I should really took them out the bubble wrap. I did take them out. Do you know what's funny is I took them out the bubble wrap to check them and then I put them back in the bubble wrap to put them back in my pin box. I don't quite know how that goes. But anyway, there's three of these and these are a limited edition of 500 as well. Um, and these are, aren't they beautiful at the front? I don't know. Symbols are all the same. So I don't think that says anything, but I could be completely wrong. But you flip this one up and you've got Minnie and Daisy. Then the next one you flip up, so that was a yellow border. So this one now is an orange border. And when you flip this one up, whoops, you've got Donald and Goofy. Any guesses what will be on the third one? Any guesses? We've got four of the main six original characters, if you like. So who's this going to be? Who's this going to be? In the red border, this is going to be... Mickey and Pluto. Aren't they lovely? And I just I just really like these pins. There's just something very special about them, the colours. There's not glitter as such, but they're just they're just beautiful. So yeah, so I've got quite a nice little Chinese New Year pin collection going on. I'm gonna need a, a pin board next year, aren't I? Just for my Chinese collection. Right, next one. I told you about this and I got this on a pin trade. No, I didn't, I bought it. I bought it, what site was it on? This might have been on weekend pin deals. I can't, I can't remember now, but it was off the lovely Oscar. So Oscar, thanks so much if you're watching. Um, and it's the last one, last one in the set I needed for the windows. So I've got the Maleficent. Will that show, can you see? It's a very dark pin. And considering how much money this one went for, um, it's not actually, whoop, my face is going to focus instead of the pin. It's not actually one of my favourites, ironically. Oh, and I love Maleficent, but I don't think that, I think this one's quite hard to see. At the top here, you've got the dragon, and you've got Maleficent there, and she obviously morphs herself into the dragon. But I don't think it's the prettiest of the Windows of Evil pins, it has to be said. 
but yeah so that's the final one now so that's my collection i don't think i've got any more up in the box i think i've, I've shown you all of those now um so that one's done so now we're on the windows of magic and then i want to put them in a frame all on their own like a shadow box but in england we don't call them shadow boxes we have to get like a deep set frame and then take the back off and then on the back of the hardboard if you like i stick on um um, adhesive cork tiles and then I cover the cork tiles with material me and my hot glue gun my new favorite toy and then I pin them on so that's how I do it because we don't have shadow boxes you can open from the front they're really really good idea and maybe I should get a couple when I'm in America next but it's getting them home isn't it because that needs to be in your hand luggage and yeah I've normally got more hand luggage than I'm meant to have anyway but Oscar bless him not only did he send me that and some stickers and yes I did pay a pretty penny for it but he also zapped me. Look, and he zapped me a Maleficent pin. So how lovely is that? So he got me a pin, because obviously I bought a Maleficent pin, and then he, he sent me that as an extra, and I just thought that was so, so kind. So thank you. So I know he said he was going to come and check the channel out. So if you're watching, Oscar, thank you. Um, yeah, and I'll happily buy off you again. And uh, yeah, thanks for being a smashing fella. So, so yeah, so those are those, right. What else have I got? Oh, right, now then. You all saw the um, fantasy pins I have off the lovely Alba over in France. Um, Alba pins, and I'll put her links down in the description. She's also picked me up some pins, and I've also had another one of her um, fantasy pins. Uh, let's show you this one first. It's for my Toy Story collection, and look, Look at that. Isn't that fantastic? And it's huge. So you've got Woody, Buzz and the little green alien. And what she does on the back of all of these is she actually puts a different um, design on the back for the pins. And uh, yeah, this is a limited edition. It's only 50 of these. But can you see it's actually like little green men on the back? Can you see? And I think that's fabulous. And so she doesn't keep to the same thing. She puts different ones on all of her pins. She likes to make it unique to the pin rather than unique to the brand. Uh, and I really like that because that's just like, pins are one-sided, but they're not, are they? To collectors, they're double-sided. So I think that's really, really special. Um, yeah, I really love that. So that's that one. I don't think I've got any more fantasy ordered with her now. I need to have a look at that. I need to maybe up my game a bit. Um, and then I've got the first two pins in a set of three because I know the one pin didn't want to come out at all in Paris. And these are just open edition ones. But these are the Wreck-It Ralph ones. So you've got Ralph and Vanellope. And then you've got Vanellope on her own. And there's one with Ralph that hadn't come out so that's on its way to me now. It's now come out. So those, those are those. Right, we've got one more envelope today. And this was a trade I did um, with the lovely Ninny, um, Stephanie over in Paris. Um, and I buy a lot of Stephanie's pins as well. And uh, yeah, she's lovely. Um, so if you're watching Ninny, hi. <laughs> And we traded, um, yeah, I'm really thrilled with these. But I'm gonna take these out of the packet now so you can see close up, because they can go on my pin board. Um, when these first come up, came out, I thought there's no way whatsoever I can afford these, because they're a limited edition of 700. Oh, I need to start in the right order, don't I? But they're a limited edition of 700, and I, even though they're only like 15.99 euros, which is about $20, um, about 15 pounds each um, they're a lot more expensive to buy because they're such limited editions only 700 um, and the secondary markets over in Paris is you know it's, it's very expensive um, but yeah she was lovely and she did a trade with me so I'm so thrilled so the first one these were for uh, Valentine's Day so it's the up, up balloon set look Isn't that fabulous? So you've got Carl and Ellie there when they were younger and she's driving. And it says in the balloon, Spirit of Adventure. 
are just, yeah. Joyo St. Valentine, so that's Happy Valentine's Day. Happy Valentine's, not day. Um, don't say jour there, yeah, but Happy Valentine's, isn't that lovely? Then, the next one in the set will be this one, where they get married. And they're balloons, so it's actually a two pin post. And we'll take this one off so I can show you what the back looks like because the Paris pins are all numbered as well. So you know which number of 700 you've got, which, you know, that's really unique, isn't it? So, so it hangs like a balloon. And if you see right down there, here, there is it, there's your number down there. You see that? And that says, is it two, four, three of 700? Yep, two, four, three of 700. So those will go on my pin board hanging like balloons. So I'm really, really thrilled. So that's the second one of those. The third one is the famous letterbox sign. So the mailbox. Isn't that beautiful? I mean, that's the movie in itself, isn't it? I think that's just beautiful. And then the last one, and they're all limited edition of 700, as I said, and this one. Because when you get married, that's what you want to do is grow old. Well, you don't want to grow old, but you want to grow old together, don't you? No one wants to get old, but together. You know what I'm going to be doing later, don't you organise my pin board? So, so I'm absolutely thrilled. So I hope you enjoyed that. Oh, fun and games. Right then, tomorrow, uh, tomorrow or Wednesday? Wednesday, I've got a bonus video for you. So check that one out. Um, if it's your first time heading over to the channel, thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe at the end and click that notification bell. That way then you'll get an email to say when I've uploaded a new video and then you can choose if you want to watch it or not. Um, but thank you. Thank you so much. Look after yourselves. Be good. Be kind. And I'll see you really soon. Bye for now, everyone. Bye.